What's up, guys? It's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to the final episode of our Pokemon Snap walkthrough. Okay, so in the last episode, we managed to go up to the uh, Rainbow Cloud and take the rarest picture of them all, and that is Mew. He gave us 8,000, 8,000, 8,880 points for that. Now, as you can see, Professor Oak is like, I've been expecting you, Draven. The Pokemon Academy has officially announced the record for the highest photo score. Now you can compete uh, compete to see how many total points you can get. I have arranged it to I arranged it so that you can see the challenge score for each course. Good luck, Draven. Do your best to beat all of the challenge scores. Now, after you've beaten po uh, Pokemon Snap and you still haven't completed the the whole you know like the whole island decks or whatever it's called, uh, you will be challenged with some points and all that stuff. And, uh, you know, it, it increases every single time, guys. After all that, it, it, there's no going around it. It's just you increasing the points every single time. So, in this episode right here, we're going to be going to every single part of this whole island. We're going to take pictures of the Pokemon we have not taken. And then from there, just, uh, you know, you know, right off into the sunset with Pokemon Snap. Because we've played this game quite a few times. And uh, I think this is enough right here. I made it better with the um with the the background right here and hopefully it goes over well for all of you guys right here too so thank you guys let's go ahead and complete this walkthrough the first place we have to actually go to is the beach yes yes there is a pokemon still there that we need to take a good picture of and including maybe make up a few good ones like uh let's say pidgey get the gus pidgey and all that stuff as you can see i'm not doing anything now, I'm just going to rush it because there is no need for me to take pictures of these guys. There maybe is one or two Pokemon that I kind of do want to take a picture of. And, well, there's one of them. And here's the next one right here. Now, if you press the flute, look at that. He is dancing. That's right. Dance the jiggle away. Do the truffle shuffle. Look at that. Do the truffle shuffle. He wakes up and he's happy. Now... The next place we want to go to is right here into this grassy area. Now, everybody's been wondering what's in this. I didn't mention before that there is a Pokemon around here. Now, if you throw a Pester Ball, you will be able to find a Pokemon. You just have to hit it. The point, the thing is that you have to hit it. And there we go. There we go. Come on. Now, this isn't the... There it is. This isn't your only place... There we go. Nothing happens if you hit it with the Pester Ball, but as you can see, you will be able to find Scyther right here. And if you press the flute, you will be finding Pikachu's right here. Boom. And that will be another part of the whole P uh, Pikachu-centric pictures that you can actually find. And look at this. Taking good pictures of Butterfreeze. Now, I did mention that this... There is another uh, area where you can actually find Scyther right here. And it's in this area. If I can only get it right. Nope. Couldn't get it. So, I got a bone to pick with you, Eevee. There we go. There we go. And, well, I think we got one more thing to do. And that is hit this guy right here. Look at that. Good pictures of Kangaskhan. Good. Now, let's try and take a very, very good picture of this one right here. Where the Pidgeys hit Meowth with a good old wind or, you know, gust attack. Now, this one right here. The last time I took a picture of this one, Professor Oak said, uh, yeah, their back is turned. That does not count as a good picture. So, we're going to try that again. And we're going to go back into the lab and see what we can actually find right here. So, let's go right ahead and... Well, I'll just press the... I'm pressing the B button right here. Alright, come on. Okay, so, let's see. We don't need Lapras. But we got the Truffle Shuffle. Look at that. That's a good picture right there. He's like pointing out. He's like, that's right. That's right. And here we have Scyther. And... Oh, crud. They're all with his back turned. Screw it. Let's go with that one. I don't care. I don't care. And if we go right here... Huh. 
Let's go with that one. It might not be my balloon Pikachu, but that's another Pikachu-centric stuff. And that one will actually do good. And... <laughs> you know, let's see. We could go with this one right here. Look. That one. And then, let's see. Uh... I don't know which one I, I, I can pick, but it could be... Let's, eh, let's go with this one right here. It's right down the middle. It's looking straight at us. Now, the, the moment of truth. There we go. And... Crud, okay. Damn it. Okay, so this is difficult right here. Let's go with that one. I, 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 I don't care. Alright, let's see what we can do. Let's see what we can find. Come on. Here we have a picture. Look at that, the good pose. Oh, come on! Aw, oh, man. You suck, Professor Oak. He's very judgmental. And Well, this is probably not going to be the best one. And yeah, that was very disappointing. It was bound to happen. And here we have Pikachu on a stump. And, well, from what it looks like, it's not going to beat it. And look, it zaps me. And, oh, wow. It beat the, oh, wow. It just beat my last score. Holy crud. Okay. <laughs> Never mind. That's a victory for me. I'll take it. I will take it. And here we have uh, Butterfree. Look at that. Bigger score. Better score. Down the middle. Yes, sir. Look at that. And here we have No Eyes Eevee. And are you serious? Okay. Okay. I was about to say, Professor Oak, you, you need to get your glasses checked. And, uh, well, look at this. Okay, so we got a 4,000 on this one on the Kangaskhan. Well deserved. And, okay, the moment of truth. Gust using Pidgey. Come on. Come on, baby. Ah. Never mind. Well, that's another one. We need six more Pokemon in order to complete this game. So we need to... Yeah, we need to find out what these six Pokemon are. Let's see. The tunnel. The tunnel. The tunnel. I think we already got everybody on the tunnel right there, so there's no need for that. So we have to go into the volcano, because I do know of two that are hiding. Now, the river right here. I think we've already gotten everybody here. Cave. We got everybody. The valley. Valley, I think. Holy crud. Okay, so... Holy crud, we are stumped. Okay, so let's see. Let's go back into the Pokemon report. There's six Pokemon? Seriously? Okay, I know Dra Dragonite's one of them. Let's see. Let's rearrange this. Let's go straight from the course right here. And let's go ahead and take a look at what we got. Okay, so... We got most of the Pokemon from the beach. We got them all. Kuna, Zubat, Douglet, Dugtrio, Magneton. Oh god, okay, so we do have one Pokemon in the tunnel that we didn't get, and that was Magnemite. Okay, so that's two... That's one right there. There's three right here, which is Growlithe and, Growl, uh, Growlithe and Arcanine. Now in the river... Vileplume, Metapod, Psyduck, Poliwag... Got them all right here. Even Porygon. And then Jigglypuff, Weeping Bell, Victory Bell, Grimer, Muck, Coughing, Jinx, Ditto, Articuno. Huh. You don't say. And then the Valley. Huh. We got them all except for Dragonite. So wait, 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 wait. I'm counting this. Okay, so we need six Pokemon. We need six Pokemon right here. Hold on. We need six Pokemon. No, we need five Pokemon. What the heck are they talking about? We need five Pokemon. So from what it looks like right here is that... We need to go straight into the tunnel to get Magna Magnemite. We need to go to the volcano to grab Growlithe and Arcanine. So that's three. The river... I'm stumped right here. We got everybody on the river. We got everybody in the cave. 
but we do need... Holy crap, this always happens! Good gravy. Okay, right here we need Dragonite. If unless I'm going to edit the wrong way. Okay, so we're going to do this one more time. Sorry, guys, if I'm delaying anything right here, but this is, uh, this, is, uh, this is something right here. So let's go right ahead and go with Pokemon Snap. Snap Pokemon. God dang it. Pokedex. Pokemon list. Okay. Pokemon Snap, all the lists. Where are they and all that stuff? Okay. Oh, this is the new Pokemon Snap. Good gravy. Uh, there we go. Pokemon Snap. Are you serious? It's not letting me... Okay. So, at the time I'm recording this whole thing right here, it is... Uh, what? May 18th? May No, May 17th right here, guys. And the Pokemon... The new Pokemon Snap has already come out. So, the thing is that I... I yeah, I can't really find... Holy crud. Okay. Pokemon Snap... Pokemon Snap, Pokemon Snap. There we go. Bulbapedia, you would never fail me. Okay. So here we go. The characters, the locations, the Pokemon. Okay. So let's go back up here. There's 63. Okay, so we do need we do need six more Pokemon. So let's go right off the top. We're gonna rearrange this whole this whole uh, shindig right here. Let's rearrange this. Let's go from uh, Pokemon number. This is what I'm looking at, okay? So, let's go with the view. And let's go straight into the list of 63 species. So, we got Bulbasaur. We got Charmander. Charmeleon. Charizard. Squirtle. Metapod. Butterfree. Kakuna. Pidgey. Hold on, hold on. Pikachu. Obviously, we, we took, like, so many pictures of, of Pikachu. The Sandshrew and Sandslash uh, line. We got Volpix. Jigglypuff. Zubat. Vileplume. Then we need Diglett. We got Duck Trio. Meowth is on there. Psyduck. Mank. Oh wow, we didn't take a picture of Mankey. Are you serious? Okay, so Mankey, Growlithe, Growlithe, and uh, and Arcanine are three of those Pokemon that we need. Uh, we got Poliwag, Whipping Bell, Geodude, Graveler. Wait, are you serious? We didn't get Graveler either. Holy bejeebus! Now, the reason why I am, like, having a little trouble remembering this, guys, is because the last time I recorded an episode on this, it was about two to three weeks ago. Hence the whole me being a little late with this whole thing. So, it looks like we got our guys. We are missing... We are missing the following. Mankey, Growlithe, Arcanine, Graveler, Magnemite... And Dragonite. Wow. Okay. Okay. Maximum effort. Let's go. Let's get this going right here. It's always good to have a Pokemon list right there at hand. So let's go straight to the course. Go to the tunnel and uh, screw our lives up by just rushing this whole thing right here. So here we are back in the tunnel. Hey, how's it going? What's up, Pikachu? What's up? Never mind. Okay, so I'm not going to rush it right here because, uh, yeah. You know, we're not allowed to hit any Pokemon right here. So, let's go ahead and talk a little bit, okay? The new Pokemon Snap game. I have not seen any any walkthrough videos on it. I have not ordered it yet, guys. I probably will later tonight and get started with it. But I heard a lot of great things about it. And, uh, you know, it's been a long time coming because, you know, this, this actually was my, um, my Christmas present at one point. Believe it or not... I actually still have the Nintendo 64 that I was given that Christmas alongside the Pokemon Snap game. These are games, and the, these are systems, or, well, the system, of course, but th these are games that you don't let go of because, you know, back in the day, back when I was a kid, Pokemon, Pokemon Mania, or Pokemania was, like, really, really big. And, you know, I'm actually glad I, I, I was actually glad to experience it. Now, I did say that Back in the day, too, there was, like, no... Like, the internet was very, like, was there. Wire, wireless or wire up and all that stuff. Uh, back then, my me and my folks, we didn't really have internet. We couldn't afford it just yet. Now that we look at it, it's like, wow, things have changed and all that stuff. And, you know, the best way to complete this whole game was to go in the school grounds and just talk to your friends. 
And for me, I had quite a few friends that actually had this game. They told me how and where to find these Pokemon and all that stuff. And wow, the times have changed, guys. The times have changed. And look at us now. Now we can actually use the internet to actually find these Pokemon. And well, here comes a Magnemite. Look at that. Okay, so there we go. We have completed that. And well, we're just gonna we're just gonna zoom out of here. Yeah. Press the R button. Get the F out of here. So yeah, there was. Those were some. Those were some of the days right there, guys. They really were, especially Christmas Day, when you know I got to see that I got a Nintendo 64 for Christmas. I was like, wow. My folks must really love me. They still do. And well, we got one Pokemon right here. Let's go ahead and grab that one and get the heck out of here. And. Uh, you know, get judged by Professor Oak because he doesn't know what a good picture looks like if he sees one. And look at that. Okay, there are other Magnemite in the picture. And that is that right there. So that completes another one. We need five more Pokemon. Welcome back. I don't want to look at you. Let's go straight to the volcano. Now, there are yes. two Pokemon right here that we need to actually find. And it's actually a good thing that I have not put in my, uh, my background on this episode because... We're going to be doing a lot of switching, moving around and all that stuff. That's a lot of work right there, especially with the work I have to do for Sword and Shield and whatnot. So what's going to happen is we're going to just uh, press the R button, get the H out of here, and, uh, well, move the Pokemon away from us because we don't want to run it over. <sighs> what else can I talk about? Now, a lot of you guys asked me, like, some of you guys asked me on Twitter, uh, why did I delete the original Pokemon Snap game? walkthrough that I had uh, back th uh, two, three years ago and restarted this one. Well, it's very simple, guys. I, you know, I didn't really feel satisfied with it. I never do. Actually, I never feel satisfied about any, any walkthrough that I do because, I don't know, that's just me. Ever since, you know, ever since I started YouTube, it was do this, do that, whatever, and, well, hold on just a sec. Okay, so again... There we go. God dang it, why do you have to be... There we go, that's one. And... There's two, and this third one. Oh, three. So we're going to have to restart this again. Okay, so there's three Growlis. There's supposed to be an Arcanine coming in. So we're going to have to go back into the, uh, into the volcano again. Holy crud. But yeah, like I was saying, guys... I never, I never get set, like I never stay satisfied with the kind of walkthroughs that I did because, or that I do because, obviously, when I started YouTube, hold on, yeah, this one, when I, when I started YouTube, yes. it was just you know make the video, upload it as quick as I can, and then from there just see if I get any any kind of uh, worthwhile views or praise or anything like that. So there we go. That's four needed. We need to go back to the volcano and all that stuff. So, yeah, I could have yes. I could have done transitions right here, you know, moving on forward. So, like I said, guys, uh, uh, it was just uh, upload and then that. But then I got partnered as Draven XC711. That worked out for a little bit before or after, you know, that worked out a little bit before, you know, uh, partnerships became obsolete. And well, I. I, I I, I can say that, yeah, I'm still getting paid to make these videos and all that stuff through YouTube. There's no more partnerships anymore, like Machinima or the uh, the Next Gamer Network or something like that. Um, but, you know, along the way, 10 years, guys. 10 years is a long time for being on YouTube, and I got to learn a lot of great things. I got to do a lot of, like, I, through YouTube, I got to learn, you know, uh, graphic design, video making, and all that stuff. It actually... It actually transferred to it actually transferred to what I'm doing right now with with football and that is that you know I'm their graphic designer as well as well as their coach so you know I guess you could say that it worked out holy crap okay it worked out in the long run because it actually afforded me a little bit more opportunities in life and doing these videos right here now I know that people judge the kind of stuff that I do. God dang it. Come on. Damn it. Okay. One more. 
Come on! Okay. We're gonna have to restart this. Yeah, like, people judge, uh, the, the type of videos that I make and all that stuff, too, and, you know, you're gonna get your, you're gonna get your, uh, your fans and your detractors and all that stuff. I've learned to have a, a, a bit of thick skin when it comes to the detractors because there's always gonna be some kind of hater and all that stuff saying that, well, you missed out on this, you can't do that, you, did, you don't do this. Never gonna satisfy everybody, guys, but... You know, you could always ask more of yourself when it comes to making these videos or YouTube and all that stuff. That's why, you know, by doing these videos, I demand myself or I demand more of myself by making these videos. And that's why you see, that's why you see all these like, you know, that's why you see me progress every single time I do this. You know, after I'm done with Pokemon Sword and Shield, it's going to be a little bit more. I'm gonna do a little bit more in a sense, and there it is. Okay, finally. Look at that. It's gonna be. I'm gonna be doing a little bit more in a sense of videography, meaning I'm going to be doing, you know, more editing onto my videos too, because, you know, stuff like this needs to be edited, trans uh, transitions and all that stuff, in order to make this video nice and short. But you know, it's uh, it's just one step, one step going into the next. So. Yeah, that's kind of what I do right here. Kind of what I do with the with the stuff that I do. If that made any sense. And, well, I like this one because of the embers and all that stuff. Yes. Now, I did hear that in the new Pokemon Snap game, it's going to be like... You can actually uh, transfer your, your stuff online. It gets judged right there. So, not only does Professor Rogue or whatever does this it, it, to judge you and all that stuff. It's the people around the world. And, bam, we need three more Pokemon to actually find. Welcome back. Okay, so let's go right ahead and go. Let's see. We already been there. Got everybody. Got everybody there. So now everything is in the valley. Hold on. Dragonite. Dragonite. Graveler. Holy crud. Did I just forget? Hold on just a sec. Okay, so let's see. Star you, Golding, Shelter, Grimer. God dang it. See, this is why I. Well, that's the way. This is why you need a transition and all that stuff. Okay, so three more Pokemon. Ma oh, Mankey. Okay, never mind. Let's go to the valley. Let's finish this off. Gattaca. Okay, the hardest place to be at. Let's get this. Okay, so yeah, it, you know, me demanding a little bit more uh, of myself in a sense that you know, you see the step up in you know quality of videos. Uh, the stuff, the, the graphic stuff, and on top of that, uh, let's see, what else? What else did I step up on? Uh, oh yeah, streaming, streaming stuff. Some of you guys, uh, you know, some of you guys uh, ask me questions. How do I, how do I record my Pokemon, uh, my Pokemon Snap video? How do I poke... How do I record uh, my Pokemon Sword and Shield video and all that stuff? And, you know, it's through YouTube that, you know, I got into advance and a lot of stuff that I have right here. So, you know, I guess YouTube, uh, you know, I guess YouTube actually finds its benefits, helps people around. And where the hell are you, Graveler? There we go. Okay. So that's another one. And we got one more person to go to. And I kind of like, I kind of just uh, left them there on purpose because it's the easiest one to actually find. But you press the C button right here and these guys start dancing. There we go. Look at that. Okay, all right. And... Alrighty, okay, so that's that. And... Well, let's see, come on. God dang it, never mind. Let's just move on. Let's just move on. We get we got to get done with this game right here. And well, let's see. Nope. You know I get tempted every single time, guys. I get I get real tempted. So let's go ahead and move on right here. Now where you can actually find Dragonite, it's right here into that whirlpool. All you got to do is hit it three times with a Pester Ball or four times, and there he will appear. Look at that. Look at that. Okay, so those are three Pokemon that. Okay, what if I hit it with a pester ball? Let's see. Nope. Nothing. Okay, it won't do anything right here. But it's flying away. Look at that. It's a nice Dragonite. Okay. What a good way. What a good way to take care of this whole situation. 
And I'll conclude this whole episode right here of me expl- explaining myself and all that crud. And, well, kind of want to take one more good picture of... Okay. Ah, come on. Okay. You know what? Screw it. It's going to happen. I'm going to take a good picture of Dratini before I get the hell out of here. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on, Dratini. Help me out. I need to prove Professor Oak wrong. Come on. Come on, Dratini. Oh, my God. No, 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 no. You suck, Dratini. Yes, I am still bitter about that picture that Professor Oak said wasn't good enough. Kind of wanted to show him up right here. Uh, okay, so... Here we have all the Pokemon, and... Well, let's see. Let's go ahead and take a look at Dratini, or Goldine. That's a good picture right there. And... Oh my god. Can this be it? Let's... Actually, let's find out. Let us find out. And, well, let's see. Since it is dancing, it will get a good picture of them dancing. So, let's go with that one. And, well, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Where is the other one? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I took some bad pictures of Mankey. Oh, my God. <sighs> okay, well. Screw it. It was meant to be. All right, let's get the heck out of here. Let's finish it off. Okay, the one that really concerns me is a Dratini, so let's see what uh, he says. Mankey, it's not going to be a good size. Yeah, that's the weakest one right there. And this is Dancing or Group Dance Graveler. And look at that. Okay, we're getting some good picture points. And, oh, wow. Oh, my God. Okay, so that would have been a good picture right there. Okay. Here it is. This is a good picture. His face is facing me. You better get this right. All right. 540. 800. Okay. Well okay! <laughs> oh, yes! It's basically the same picture as the last time. Holy crud, Professor Oak. You are... You are a delicate one. Or a difficult one. And here we have... Uh, oh, wow. They're... Yeah, they're both the same. Never mind. Okay, we tied. Okay! The, oh, what? We need one more Pokemon to complete the list. What the hell? Huh. Magnemite. Back. We got Graveler. The hell? Are you serious? Hold on. Hold... Oh, God. This is a... Yeah, this is the funniest picture... Or this is the funniest episode ever. All right, again, let's go back onto the list. We got Bulbasaur, Charmander, Charizard, Squirtle, Metapod, Butterfree, Kakuna, Pidgey, Pikachu, Sandshrew, Sandslash, Vulpix, Jigglypuff, Zubat, Vileplume, Diglett, Dictyo, Meowth, Phaseiduck, Mankey, Growlithe, Arcanine, Poliwag, Whipping Bell, Victory Bell, Geodude, Graveler, Rapidash, Slowpoke, Slowbro, Magnemite, Magneton, Doduo, Grimer, Muck, Shelder, Cloyster, Haunter, Electrode, Coughing, Chancing, Kangaskhan, Goldeen, Star You Star Me, Scyther, Jinx, Electabuzz, Magmar, Magikarp, Gyarados, Lapras, Ditto, Eevee, Porygon, Snorlax, Articuno, Moltres, uh, wait, oh, damn it, oh my god, <laughs> oh my god, okay, so this is the goofiest episode ever for Draven. Because he completely forgot about Dragonite. So, we're going to have to go back to the valley. Okay. Alrighty. Like I said, guys, I am about to take the next step into the quality of videos that I make. That is, if ever stuff like this happens, there's going to be, you know, 
you know, very, very good editing. So in the meantime, enjoy me screwing up like like no like nobody else's business. And you know what? This this is you know what? This is good. This is actually going to give us a good opportunity to take a good picture of of uh, Mankey. I am not going to leave here with Mankey, you know, looking like crap at all that stuff. So let's go ahead and do that. Let's go ahead and find uh, a Pokemon, some kind of Pokemon right here. Oh my god. I'm still trying to beat that score with uh, Dratini. Oh! Oh, I might beat it. I might beat it with that one. Okay, so let's see. Yes, you can tell that I'm highly competitive, guys. Very competitive. So competitive that everybody else is obsolete. So let's go right ahead and do this. I don't need to take pictures of that guy. We need to take better pictures of Mankey, though. And leave it at that. It was meant to be, guys. It was. It was meant to be. Let's go ahead and take a better picture of this guy. Stop jumping up and down. And let's start floating around right here. And yes, Magikarp will magically appear right here. Where are you? There you are. Okay. Bam. Hit him. It evolves into Gyarados. Look at that. Oh, yes. Okay. Now, let's get down to the nitty gritty. Good old Draven forgets Dragonite. This is a dumbass move by your good old boy Draven. So let's go ahead and just get these curves. I'm already used to this. Do this again. There we go. Four. Look at that. Look at that. Okay. Good pictures of Dragonite. We are done. Let's go ahead and take a better picture of uh, Mankey right here too. Now. This right here activated the whole, you know, signs thing. When you hit this guy to Mankey, he will follow it. Now, I figured out the reason to why I didn't do anything, didn't take any pictures of Mankey, was because I was trying to activate the, the whole uh, Professor Oak signs thing. Oh, why'd you do that? Why are you... God dang it. So here it is, a better picture of Mankey. Hit him. And he misses the button. Okay, so let's see. Let's go ahead and do it one last time here, guys. Complete screw up episode of good old Draven with Pokemon Snap right here. Come on. Okay, I'm going to throw a pester ball at Professor Oak right there. Look at that. <laughs> okay, so don't forget the Dragonite picture. That's all there is to it, okay? So let's go right ahead and press the button. Come on, come on. All right. Oh my god, I have taken better pictures. Oh my god, this is the best one. Okay, I'm going to beat it. I am going to beat it. Let's go ahead and, uh, there we go. Mankey, a better picture of Mankey. And, oh my god, a better picture of Goldeen. And look at this. Do not forget Dragonite. Okay. Okay, and there's one of Geodude that I didn't yes. meant, mean to take, so here we go, Dratini again, okay, let's see, okay, alrighty, and oh, we lose by 60 points right there, finally, Dragonite pointing at you, look at this, it's good, It's everything is good, it's in the middle, that's right, and here we have a closer version of Goldeen, come on, give us more, Alrighty, so we beat that picture, and look at this, Mankey, our crappiest picture, look at that, smokes it out of the water, and bam, finally, okay, and there it is, guys, we have won, we have finished the whole episode, thank you, Jeebus. You have completed the Pokemon report. Draven is a genuine Pokemon or photo photogra a photographer. God dang it, I can't even speak it right. Congratulations. I have nothing left to teach you. You didn't really teach me anything, homie. Listen to your instincts and click the shutter when you see something that looks cool. Pokemon research on this island seemed long at first, but it really went by fast. I appreciate all, uh, all of your help. Well then, see you later. See you. Okay, so let's go ahead and press that button and finish this episode. Okay, guys. 
that was a that was a interesting episode wouldn't you agree it was a very interesting episode so here is my sign off for uh this game and the walkthrough and everything i will be playing the new pokemon snap walkthrough or the new pokemon snap game pretty soon here guys i'm just gonna have to learn it figure it out and all that crud and know the ins and outs and all that stuff i have not looked over any videos about it nor any walkthroughs so uh, my mind is going clear into this whole thing so keep an eye out for that um it is going to be an interesting summer here too guys because uh we will be playing pokemon sun and moon very very soon in june so keep an eye out for that too and you know things are just going to continue i am keeping true to the promise that i made with coming out with pokemon coliseum if time allows me there will be a few episodes on that but as far as we're concerned with anything else this has been an interesting walkthrough interesting everything this will be the last time i play pokemon snap the original game right here on my channel i hope it's better than the last time and i hope that you guys love it like i said early on in this episode there is going to be a step up in uh, the quality of editing and all that stuff guys um, it's just the evolution of me, Gym Leader Draven, right here. And hopefully, just hopefully by the end of the year, we'll get to 10,000 subscribers. I am looking at this right now, and I think we just hit 9,000 subscribers. So, thank you guys again for subscribing. Thank you guys again for uh, the support. I will see you guys in the next walkthrough, which will be the new Pokemon Snap walkthrough. Thank you guys. See ya.